Hello, Poker News. My name is Aaron Webster, and I'm here with Ryan Hansen, who just won his first WSOP bracelet. Not your first tournament. You actually won in, uh, you actually cashed in 2011, but this is your first bracelet. <laughs> yes. How does that make you feel? Um, it's, it's, it's astounding. I, I never would have expected to be in this spot. It's the dream of every poker player to have a bracelet, um, and never thought it happened to me, but here I am. <laughs> so it's crazy. You're actually not even much of a tournament player. You actually do cash games. Never really took a shot at a tournament this year. I came out here and uh, decided to take, you know, a shot at it, and it worked. Had some fun. Ran, ran good at the right times and uh, played good enough to win it. So, that's... Do you think there's a difference in cash game strategy versus tournament strategy? For sure. Um, uh, in, in cash, it's a lot of thin margin, and, and, in, and in tournaments, about uh, holding on to chips and making sure you don't go bust. <laughs> so, got to play it a little bit differently. And it paid off. It, it did. <laughs> So you describe yourself as having more of a moneymaker effect. Do you think Chris Moneymaker's win in 2003 influenced you to play in tournaments at all? Um, it, you, you know, I mean, I say moneymaker effect, and part of it was just that poker was catching on, like, everywhere, and it was just like they started holding local tournaments, you know, and, and so I was like, all right, so I'll join that. Um, and, and so it was just like I just got caught up in the whole swing of things, not so much Chris himself, but just the fact what he brought to the game and I just got caught up in that that swing. So that's what happened. At the right time. <laughs> well, it took me, what, 19 years or 18 years <laughs> before I got my own, so yeah. Well, congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Ryan Hansen. Congratulations on your first bracelet. To follow along with all live updates as they happen, make sure you check out pokernews.com, powered by Club GG.